here in the books of dash dash the question the question is gaurav applied for 5000 shares of tenis at a premium of 2.5 per share but he was allotted only 2500 shares on pro rata basis and the last line is pass journal entries to record the forfeiture and reissue of shares here it is a case of a pro rata in the books of dash dash limited working notes note 1 distribution of amount and the number of installments per share application rupees 3 allotment rupees 2 plus 2.50 for securities premium reserve and gaurav failed to pay on 2500 shares his allotment money first call rupees 2 hence gaurav also failed to pay first call on his shares Second and final call is again rupees three and total amounted to rupees ten and two point five is the securities premium reserve and total is rupees twelve point five zero. Second and final call in this case has not been made. Now we have to calculate amount due on allotment and not paid by Gaurav. Here statement of allotment. Note two that is applications received and shares allotted. Application received five thousand, shares allotted two thousand five hundred. Total is rupees five thousand for applications received and shares allotted two thousand five hundred. Next one is note three calculation of allotment money not received from Gaurav. That is number of shares allotted to Gaurav that is equal to two thousand five hundred shares. Number of applications received that is five thousand applications. Hence, application money received that is five thousand applications at the rate of rupees three per application. Hence, Gaurav paid us rupees fifteen thousand in all. Whereas his due money on allotment less application money due that is twenty five hundred at the rate of rupees three, which is rupees seven thousand five hundred. Hence. He paid in excess rupees seven thousand five hundred. That is excess of application money. That is seven thousand five hundred, which will be adjusted in allotment due. Less allotment due from Gaurav. That is twenty five hundred shares at the rate of four point five zero, including securities premium reserve. That is rupees eleven thousand two hundred fifty, and hence the excess will be allotment money not received. That is. Rupees three seven five zero, allotment money not received. Rupees three seven five zero. Next one is fair notes. It is journal entries of Dash Dash Limited. We will be drawing five columns: date, particulars, ledger for Leo, debit, credit with rupee symbols. The first journal entry regarding forfeiture of twenty five hundred shares of Gaurav will be. Share capital account debited twenty five hundred into seven because we hold till seven application allotment fast call seven rupees. It is twenty five hundred into seven that is seventeen thousand five hundred. Securities premium reserve has not been received. Securities premium reserve account debited that is twenty five hundred into two point five that is rupees six two five zero. To share for future account that is fifteen thousand a forfeited shares account amount forfeited from Gaurav rupees fifteen thousand. To share allotment account allotment amount not received as per working note number two rupees three seven five zero. To share fast call account to share fast call account that is rupees five thousand that is two thousand five hundred shares at the rate of rupees two per share. Being the narration is being twenty five hundred shares forfeited due to non payment of allotment and first and final call money. Second one is second one entry is reissue. It is bank account debited. These shares reissued for rupees twenty thousand. It is written these shares are reissued at rupees eight twenty five hundred at the rate of rupees eight. That is rupees twenty thousand. Securities and the next one is. The next one is 
forfeited shares account debited it is 2 rupees per share that is 2500 at the rate of 2 it is 5000 this is also called a discount on reissue account two share capital account is 2500 at the rate of rupees 10 share capital account that is 2500 at the rate of rupees 10 being 2500 forfeited shares reissued at the rate of rupees 8 per share fully paid next one is third entry share forfeited to capital reserve it is 10000 share forfeited account debited to capital reserve being profit on forfeiture and reissue of shares transferred to capital reserve account 15000 is forfeited amount out of that we gave rupees 5000 discount on reissue hence 10000 will be capital reserve and the final amount will be rupees 50750 total is rupees 58750 debit and credit column and this is the final answer